Hello everybody, welcome back to Astroneer. <clears throat> You'll have to excuse my voice a little bit today, I'm getting over a cold. I still can't shake that nagging cough, it's very annoying, but uh, we will push through. So, first thing I would like to address, as several people pointed out to me, I didn't need to have arms on these platforms passing the goods to these canisters. It's actually a lot more efficient to just leave the canisters on the platforms. Now, there's two reasons why I had it with arms. The first and most important reason is I forgot you could do this and it worked. Uh, the second reason was I was sort of, I mean, I want to make it sound like I had a plan and I did. I wanted to see if that would work and how effectively that would work for use in larger machines down the road. But for now, for now, this is obviously the most efficient and most practical way to do this. Let's just pop that in there. So I've removed all the extra arms. I made a bunch of packages and started packaging a bunch of the stuff that I don't really need to have going, but my goodness, is there a lot of stuff just lying around now? I tried to tidy it up a little bit, but uh, I kind of just wanted to get on with this, you know? So as for today, as for today, I figured, you know, we've done, we've done a lot of automation the last couple of episodes. I think, I think it's time to start going and doing a bit more exploring again in some of the other planets. Because, I mean, I need, I need a whole bunch of materials, right? We, 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 we are quite low on several things. Uh, what's that? That's aluminium. We've got heaps of aluminium. We've got a lot of clay. But I don't have any, I don't have any titanium whatsoever. And, uh, basically no zinc. Oh, got a lot of tungsten, which is surprising. I need a bunch of stuff so I can get on with building the large rover and a paver. Once I can do that, once I've got that established, then I can actually make a push to activating the portals on every planet and the cores, and it should all be fairly straightforward. So I'd like to do all that. I also want to make a large shredder because this just isn't doing it. And I have an idea for an automated shredding thing, which, you know, should be good for a laugh, I reckon, at the very least. So today, figure out what we need, what we need to take with us onto some of the other planets, what we haven't done there. I've got a quest to hand in right now, so let's just do that real quick. Aha, advanced explorer kit. Yeah, I may, I, I unlocked each of those because I've got so much research now. That gets me a delightful QTRTG. Again, these things are brilliant, so I'm going to bring that with us actually. And what else have we got? What else have we got? Okay, so there's still that. There's still eyes on lithium. Even though I got lithium, I never found it on the planets. So there's that. There is uh, shelters. Shelter on each planet. I haven't done Vasania, Novus, Glacio, or Aatrox. Uh, there is unearthed. I need to print an extractor and go build that. But that's something I'll do on this planet. Composite perfection. Refine nanocarbon alloy. That that can wait. Uh, unlocked potential. Unlock 100 schematics in the catalog. I will get there eventually. And then of course there's the other galastropods. And to find them I need to do this galastropod stuff. So this is what we're going to do first. We're going to provide as a, an exo chip to the xenobiology lab. Which will improve its tracking. And should tell us where the next galastropod is. So then we'll focus our next efforts on whatever that planet is. And, uh, and head in that direction. So, uh, place it here? Yes. There we go. All right, updated. Provide Exo Biology Lab with a thingy. Aha. Okay, Glastropod Vasania, princess. A tough companion who will shield you from the harshest environments when well fed. Princess won't let you come to harm while she's riding in your backpack. Lovely. Novus Rogal. A mysterious and powerful companion who energizes technology when well fed. Rogal generates a surprising amount of power for one so small, no matter where they reside. Lovely. And then there's just the last two, which we'll get after we've got these two, presumably. So Vasania and Novus. We've been to both those places, so we have little basic setups there. I'm going to take the dynamite with us so that we can... Uh goodness, words, so that we can blow up any exo caches we find. And I want to make a couple of those large storage kajigas that I've got on the large rover here, or the medium rover. Uh, large platform, that's, no, 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 that's, that's not it, that's not the one, that's not the one. It is, where is it? That thing, large storage, so ceramic. We've got tons of ceramic now. 
uh, which should be, yeah, ceramic. There we go. How much of that have we got? A lot. Excellent. So I'm going to try and make, I don't want that. Oh my gosh. I'm going to try and make two of these things and load them on the shuttle. Oh, also, also, while that's printing, I have for now given up on automating these two arms because honestly, I just, I just, I, I've had a few ideas that I've tried out in a creative world just to see what would work and I just can't get it to work quite the way I want it to so while I'm still still mulling over that they're just gonna remain here I'll just have to remember to turn them on and off whenever I'm using this honestly that's fine these ones this these work these work this switches off as intended when this platform is empty and it switches off with just enough time to let the arm load the item into the canister so that's that's fine that's like what's that nine arms one two three four five six seven eight nine nine arms that all turn off automatically so that'll do honestly that'll do all right get this loaded onto the shuttle because this way i can carry a lot of goods on the shuttle wait why are you not letting me Right, need to unbox it, and then I can play. Oh, come. <laughs> we'll get there eventually. Oh my gosh, we'll get there eventually. Let's grab you off there for now. And will you fit on there? You will. Cool. I think that'll be handy on the uh, on the other planets to have all that stuff. Also, a thought just occurred. We could set up an atmospheric condenser. We're going to Vasania and to Novus, but. It looks like the majority of the gases are on Aatrox. I mean, the other places as well, like Novus has hydrogen and methane, but we've got plenty of hydrogen here. Uh, nitrogen we can get here as well. This really... Oh, Argon can be gotten on Vasania. Okay, all right, well, we're going to take an atmospheric condenser with us as well then, so we can, um, so we can set that up on uh, Vasania. I think that's it. That was Vasania, wasn't it? Oh, gosh, my memory. Yeah, you set up there. See now, now, now we have so much more storage space. Okay, I packaged up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Atmospheric condenser packaged up. You go there. Uh, what else do we need? What else do we need? We're gonna need. We're gonna need a couple of large platforms. So I've packaged those up already. So pop that into there like that uh probably some better solar panels would be good better than the little ones uh we'll take the yeah we'll take the rtg with us portable smelter that'll probably be handy the horn for the uh for the little guy for the oh gosh galastropod yes 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 i know words uh and oh yes we need a canister to collect the gas in which i think is made from this one yeah 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 silicone and gas uh, <laughs> silicone and glass what do we need for silicone again silicone is methane right which we don't have right okay well hang on that carries that holds gas so we don't need this one that's like a bigger one. Fluid and uh, medium gasket. Well, hang on. How was I gathering up the nitrogen before? Or did I not have a... I didn't have a caster for it yet, did I? And that just holds hydrazine. Right, okay. Okay, methane is on Novus. Methane is on Novus and Aatrox, but Novus. All right. All right, change of plans. We're going to Novus. We're going to set this up on Novus so I can get methane. And then that will help me make gas canisters and I can set up gas collection on the other planets. Yes, 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 that makes sense. Okay. So what else do we need? Oh, we're going to need a landing platform. So I need to make a landing pad, which is from this guy. So landing pad, landing pad, aluminium and ceramic. Easy. Uh, we may as well also do the habitat there because that is something that we need. All right, and habitat, 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 shelter, plastic and silica. Oh, wait, no, 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 no. That's the big one. That's the big one. Where's the little one? That's the full size habitat. I want the little one. Where is it? Where's the little shelter? Oh, have I have I gone straight past it? Medium shuttle, large shuttle, shelter. That's the big shelter. This is why I dislike the menus in this game. There it is. Oh, I never unlocked it. 
Oh, oh, I must have just been given them and I've used ones I've been given and this needs silicone anyway, so... Okay, so we're not doing that today. Never mind then. There's our landing pad though, that's good. Uh, oh, 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 and the small cadre of printers. One of each printer, please. Thank you. All right, that's just about done. Boom, large printer done. Okay, oh, come, I'm getting stuck on stuff. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. There's one last thing that I want to take with us, and it's uh, one of these platforms. Not that, just that platform. What is that, like platform B? Yeah, large platform B. That's gonna need you guys. I think three of them? What am I, what am I full of? Oh, aluminium. Oh, okay. So, large platform B. Large platform B. There it is. Needs three resin. As I suspected. Let's get that building. I'm just gonna go put this aluminium away where, it meant, where it's meant to be before I forget and lose it. Actually, I'm just gonna do this. Boop. Done. Love that. Love that so much. Fantastic. It is ready. I am ready. I think it is time for us to head to... Where were we going? Novus. Novus. Yes, 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 yes. Uh, how are we for fuel? Oh, we could, we could have a little bit more fuel. So, okay. Oh, I don't really want to do... Actually, look, that's great. Let's turn that back on because that's got an empty slot now. I used all of the extra hydrogen in the research chambers because I discovered you can actually put gas in the research chambers. So that's what I did. That's coming back to life. And it will switch off once it's full. That's great. Let's just pop you. I didn't need that in my inventory. Pop that on there. And away we go. Um, launch to another planet. Here we go. <laughs> I love that from space you can see the little area on silver that I've been gradually flattening and expanding out for the base. Oh dear. Okay. Yep. Hydro hydrogen, methane. Oh, and I can go for the lithium here as well. Yes, 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 yes. The thing that we didn't find last time we were here. So here we are. Okay. Can we find our old landing spot? That's going to be the tricky thing. Did I place a beacon down? Did I place? I did! Oh, I was smart. I was smart. I put a beacon down. Good on me. Good on me for putting down a beacon. Yeah, there's the... <laughs> there's the crappy little base that I set up here. Oh yeah, research item. Okay, I'll take that home. Oh, and the other portable smelter. I left it here. Oh. Okay. Okay. So, oh, I didn't even need to bring a large printer then. Well, that'll be for the next place. Let's make the landing pad. I'll just move all this stuff out of the way and build our nice landing pad. Our landing pad there. I think that should be fine. Oh, perfect. I just want to let's swing it around. Swing it around. Swing it around. I'm going to place it like there-ish. There we go. So now, we should have a mission for the next Glastropod. Why? 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 Hang on. Hang on, did I... Did I have to do something to actually get it to tell me where the next one was? Oh my gosh. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to make a real quick trip back to Silver, and I'll be back here in a moment. Okay. So, it turns out, it was there the entire time. I did have it. I just went past it several times. <laughs> huh. Oh well. Let's find some shells. There's bound to be some around here somewhere. In fact, I'm pretty sure that the last time we were here on Novus, I even scanned a few of them. Um, oh, also, I put down some new tethers so that the tether line is still uh, supplied with oxygen. I left a bunch of stuff here too. Huh. Oh, okay. Let's find some shells. Okay. I spent a little bit of time having a look around on the surface for the shells. I can't seem to find any there. 
So I'm guessing that there just aren't any on the surface, but I do remember seeing them down underground. So uh, that's what we're going to do. Let's just check this out too, see how this is going. Nice, that thing still works. That's fabulous. All right. Oh, what's that? Just a mushroom. Right. Okay, never mind. Oh, I got to turn this off too. That's going to make things difficult. There we go. Wait, I'm doing that thing again where I didn't read the thing and I'm sure the thing told me where I'll find them. Novus shells. A glastropod that ventured to this exotic moonlit. Scan its discarded shells found within the crumbling stones within the caverns. Okay. I'm glad I actually bothered to read that this time. I may as well grab the clay while I'm here. <laughs> Nova shell. Bingo. That's one. Because I remember that was in like a bit of a bit of rock. Ah, 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 ah. There we go. Crumbling stone. Bingo. <laughs> okay. See, see, I'm learning my lesson. It pays to read. What the heck is that? What? Lapis porn? What? What is that? What is that? And why can't I pick it up? Is it like... Is it... So, there, there you go, there you go. A pawn? As in a chess piece? What? Okay, well that's curious. But there's Nova shells done. Oh, there was another one right there. Love it. So let's head back up, grab the terrarium, and uh, be on our way to collect our next new little friend. There we go. Love it, love it. Uh, before I actually forget and drop something, I'm gonna pop the pawn that I found onto the ship and also these materials. Cool, all right. Oh wait, no, 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 not the, not the tethers. What are you doing? Not the tethers. Uh, where's the horn? I packed the horn. There it is. Pop you on there. Needs to be filled with specific items before it is ready. Ah, yes, 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 yes. What does this one need? It's going to need soil, iron, and a thistle whip seed. Iron? Really? There's iron here? Huh. Okay then. All right. Well, let's let's just take care of the soil first. I'm assuming oil is oil. I'm assuming iron is going to be down under the surface somewhere. That makes sense, right? Yeah? Okay. I'll pop you off. Where's my soil canister? Right there. That's the soil. Pop you back on there. Okay. And a thistle whip seed. There were thistle whips around somewhere nearby, and I killed one of them. I'm sure of it. Maybe up on this, uh, this ledge up here. Let's have a quick look. Because I know... I know I saw one and I killed it because I don't like them because they're big and scary and they will kill me. I wonder if the seed stayed behind actually. So that's... Is that you? Are you a thistle whip? What the heck? Oh my gosh! Okay! Wait, do those... Yeah, they explode! Alright, I don't think that's a thistle whip. That's a noxious catapult. Let's just kill that right quick. And what are you? You're a lash leaf. That is also quite scary. All right, let's kill you. Now where's um, where's a thistle? Th thistle th blah, blah, blah. thistle whip. Where is a thistle whip? And not get close to too close to you. Oh what? <gasps> what the? Okay, so last time when I was here and I found that single rose that was an in fact an entire crater full of those roses. That is so pretty. Oh wow, okay, all right. Well, if I, there's another one there. Um, interesting. Oh, oxygen, right. Yes, that thing that we need. All right. I know I've seen thistle whips here and obviously they are here because it's part of the requirement. But where did I see them? It, it's got to be up along the ledges, I reckon. 
up along, up along the tops of the, the craters, I, I assume there's another of the lash leaf thingies, whatever they're called. There's another one there. Is it? Yeah, lash leaf. I'm just going to put down some tethers before I forget and before I die. Yes, good, good. No suffocating. No suffocating. Suffocating bad. Oh, what was that? Oh, it's one of you. Just stop it. Stop spitting at me. I'm not a threat to you. Unless you threaten me and then I'm a very big threat. Um, huh. I don't see any thistle whips. Oh, in the Astropedia, does it actually show me what they look like? Let's see. Planets ha hazards. Yes, it does. Thistle whip. <laughs> this would have been useful previously, but here we are. So thistle whip. All right. So as I expected, it's just like really, really tall. I gotta find a really, really tall plant and kill it. Oh, hey. Yes, 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 yes. I knew there was another one here somewhere. So while I struggle to find a uh, thistle whip, is that? No, not over there. While I struggle to find a thistle whip, I can just drop that exo cache down there to open it later. Boom. Love it. Aha! Ah I found one. I found one. Yes. Thank you. Thank you for your sacrifice. So let's go give this to the terrarium and on with the next stage. Oh, iron. I need to find iron crap sticks. Hmm. Okay. Uh, yes, now. Now, 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 now. Dynamite. Might just move the cache slightly further away, because the dynamite is, um... Well, I mean, it's explosive, yeah. It's, like, it's very explosive. I sh probably shouldn't have dropped it down here. I've just made more work for myself. That's okay. That's it's fine. It's absolutely fine. Let's bring it over here, where I'm not going to lose anything. Dynamite. Detonate, run away. <laughs> oh my god. It's so loud. Oh. oh, nice. Oh, gather up some scrap. Yes. Much like the shells, I assume on this planet I'm mostly going to find iron underground. I know on Glacio, iron's on the surface, and I'm really tempted to just fly over to Glacio and grab some iron and not bother about trying to find it here. But we'll give it a go, you know, we'll, we'll give it a go. We're here. That's not iron, that's sphalerite. Sphalerite? I'll remember them one of these days. What is it? It is laterite. That's the one. Laterite becomes aluminium. Yes. Oh, is that some there? Hey! <laughs> I found it. That's not the button I want. I want this button. Yes. I found iron. That's awesome. That's all I need. My auxiliary oxygen tank is nearly empty. So let's just go. Love it. Okay, didn't need to go to Glacio. That's even better. Hammer Crap. Um, <laughs> we need iron, not hematite. But I've got this baby. So let's grab you. No, I want... I dislike how it automatically grabs stuff, but that's fine. Let's just turn that on. Let's do the thing. Yeah, fine, fine. Make the make the stuff. That's fine. Whatever. Iron. Oh, look at that. That's so neat. I love these little terrariums. On, in place. There it is. Let's go make a new friend. Hi! Alright, so do they like the moonwalk like all the others have done? Yes! It does. Um, where did it go? Where did it go? So it turns out there's this handy thing called a compass. I don't know if any of you have noticed it before, but it's in the game and it's really handy. It shows where points of interest are, like this little guy. Oh, he's singing. Uh, 
That's not what I meant to do. He wants me to dance. Where'd you go, little buddy? There he is. Let's get him. Also, while I was looking for him, I found another pawn. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, they're so adorable. Let's make another friend. Oh. Man, the Glastropods are so cute. I absolutely love their addition to the game. It's such a neat little thing, and somehow it just fits. Even though there's not really any other creatures that you see, it doesn't feel out of place that there's Galastropods around that you can, you know, befriend. It's brilliant. And what was his name? What was his name again? Rogel. Rogel the Galastropod. Awesome, he's ready for his trip home. Now before we leave, the other thing I wanted to come here and do was set up the uh, the gas extraction, the atmospheric condenser. So we're going to do that, and then we're going to head home. So platform, and I need the larger platform, and I need... Well, I brought a large printer. I don't need it yet, but I brought it in case I need it. And there's that. And we may as well use the RTG. And let's see, what else? What else do we want? I brought a solar panel, didn't I? Yeah, 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 there it is, medium solar panel. Small wind turbine, because the wind here isn't great and... Actually, let's see, what does it say in the Astropedia? Uh, sun high, wind high. Oh. Okay, cool. That is not the impression I'm getting from the amount of wind down here, but it could be because we're in a little sheltered valley, I don't know. I don't know. This will do for now, though. It really doesn't need to be all that uh, advanced. Productivity first. Neatness later. Oh gosh, don't... No, jeez. <laughs> Best not to, you know, crush myself underneath the weight of a gas extractor. What am I doing here? Methane, was it? I think it was methane. Yeah, 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 methane. Do your thing. Oh, we got another uh, wind turbine. We'll chuck that down. In there. Yeah, cool. Done. That's my methane extractor, for, for now, anyway, until I can make canisters, the other medium canisters that can hold a bunch of gas, because that will make transporting the gas a whole lot more efficient, and I actually need the methane to make those. Hence we've, uh, hence we've come here. Fabulous. We have our first container of methane. So, I think, I think, we're gonna head home, we're gonna head home back to Silva. We're gonna put uh, Rogel with his buddies. And you know what? I reckon, I reckon, they need a, uh, they need a proper, like a proper platform. Somewhere where they can see trees and they can see mountains and all kinds of stuff. You know what I mean? Oh, I didn't actually get him out of the shuttle, did I? I also grabbed, just before we left, I grabbed uh, five fractal roses from Novus so that I can plant them on different planets because apparently, apparently they grow differently on each planet and I think that'll be really neat. But anyway, there's Rogel. There's Rogel with his friends. There's Sylvie, there's Usagi, and there's Stilgar. Stilgar, the, uh, the quiet, silent type. Lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Oh, and, and of course, we got our exochips and a couple of a couple of chess pieces, which is fascinating. So, gonna have to make a chessboard at some point, I guess. So, I guess there'll be there'll be more chess pieces, I guess. And we got our first we got our first canister of methane, which we can use to make what was it? Silicone, I think. Was it silicone? Yeah, silicone with resin and quartz, which I've got, which will let us make gas canisters, which will let us set up proper gas collection stations on each planet. I'm looking forward to that. I hope you're looking forward to that. I thank you all for joining me once again. And I'll see you next time. Bye bye. This episode was brought to you by my very generous patrons.